Hi everyone, I hope you are having a great day today, and welcome back to my new video. On this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to install Dynamic Island and set position Dynamic Island of the notch for unsupport iPhone. As you know, I have discussed a lot of videos regarding installing Dynamic Island on any iPhone, but there is no way to manually set the size and position of the Dynamic Island. So when you install Dynamic Island on an unsupported iPhone, the layout of the Dynamic Island cannot be adjusted. As you can see in this video, I can adjust the position of the Dynamic Island right below the notch on this iPhone. So in this video, I will explain how to enable Dynamic Island and set its position as you want. First, you have to install Troll Store first on your device because this app only support for Troll Store or Jailbroken device. As you know, Troll Store support for iOS 16 and 17 for now. You can check on their official Troll Store, or you can check the link download Troll Store on description. Here, I will try to install Troll Store with Troll Installer X. Please download the Troll Installer X file first. After the file has been downloaded, then sideload the troll installer using Sideloadly, Alt Store, or you can use Feather without using a computer. You can see my previous video on how to install Feather on your device. If you already have Feather, you can open the Feather app, then import the troll installer file that you downloaded earlier. Then click Sign and install the troll installer on your device. Wait a few moments until the Troll Installer is successfully installed on your iPhone. After the Troll Installer has been successfully installed, please run the Troll Installer. Then click the Install Troll Store button. Then your iPhone will automatically restart. After restarting, please look for the Tips app, because through the Tips app you can install Troll Store. If you don't have the Tips app, Please download it first on the App Store, then reinstall Troll Store via Troll Installer. After you open Tips app, please click Troll Store and Persistence Helper, and your device will reboot quickly. After that, Troll Store has been successfully installed on your device. After Troll Store has been successfully installed, you need another application called Bootstrap. Please download Bootstrap for Troll Store. You can check the link in the description. After the Bootstrap file is downloaded, please install Bootstrap via Troll Store. Click the plus button, then select the Bootstrap file that you downloaded earlier. After that, open Bootstrap, then install Bootstrap by pressing the button in the middle. Then your device will restart quickly. After that, open Bootstrap, then click App List, then enable Settings in Bootstrap. After that, you will see the Cilio app. Please open the Cilio app. Then click the source section on Cilio. Click the plus button above and add the following link to get the custom dynamic island feature. After this source, repo link has been successfully added. Please click and search for visible island. You will see two types of visible island and root hide. Please click Root Hide because you installed it with Troll Store. Click Get and install Visible Island. Then restart your device. And automatically, Dynamic Island will be enabled on your device. 
To enable Dynamic Island on your device, please go to Settings. Scroll down until you see Visible Island Menu. Click that and enable and set the Dynamic Island position what you want. You can try the features on the Visible Island. Please enable Custom Island Position to set the Dynamic Island Position. And also, you can hide the Dynamic Island if you are not using it. You can also customize notifications, size, color, and width. After you have set everything, don't forget to click Save. Then, finally, click Respring to apply the changes. Then your device restarts quickly. And yeah, you have successfully enabled your custom Dynamic Island. This Dynamic Island feature is the same as the Dynamic Island on the latest iPhone 14 Pro or iPhone 16. There is no difference in the Dynamic Island function. Please adjust the size of the Dynamic Island if you feel the position of the Dynamic Island is not suitable. Please edit again and set the custom island position and respring. This visible island is useful for customizing the position and size of the dynamic island that is blocked by the notch on your old iPhone. So with the visible island, you can position it however you like and it won't be obstructed by the notch. Okay, thanks for watching this video. If you need a help to install visible island, please leave your comment below so I will help you to get it or join to our telegram group to get help. See you on the next video.